Another day, another babysitter story time. Uh, so yeah, sit back, relax, grab something to drink, grab something to eat, and let's just get right into it. So I'm going to call the subscriber who sent in today's video, we're going to call him Kevin. And yes, I got the name from the comment section suggestions, so leave your name suggestions. I'll eventually get around to trying to do as many of them as I can. But anyways, right, the subscriber who sent in today's story is, we'll call him Kevin, right? At this point, right, Kevin... He was on the older side, but, you know, at the same time, he was on the older side. He still needed a babysitter. His parents weren't 100% comfortable with leaving him alone in the house. So anyways, right, it's a normal time when, like, a babysitter would come over. Kevin's parents had some place to be, and they needed a babysitter. So they called up someone kind of local or whatever, and it wasn't, like, super sketchy or anything. Like, she was a, she was, like, the daughter of, like, some mother who was, like, pretty active in the towns. I don't know. Like, you know how there's kind of, like, activities there's like kind of like in the social scene i guess with like involvement camps and like there was like a local it wasn't like a country club it wasn't fancy like that but it was some kind of like youth center that that, that also doesn't sound right <laughs> anyways right you know the mom was pretty popular in the town is what i'm trying to say she was pretty active so you know, you know kevin's mom just made the assumption that the you know the daughter would be pretty chill or whatever or she just wouldn't do anything weird well that was not the case to say it lightly that was simply not the case. Anyway, so this all starts when Kevin is just chilling in his room. Maybe he's playing, you know, a little Xbox. Maybe he's, you know, playing a little Fortnite. I don't know when this thing came out. That could have been, you know, could have been a couple of years ago. I don't know, man. Maybe he's playing a little Minecraft. Maybe he's out there on his grind mining some Bitcoin. Yeah, I'm back to those jokes, baby. You can't stop me. And he was, uh, you know, and he's just chilling there when he hears the doorbell ring. So, of course, you know, as in every, as in every situation, as in every babysitter story as well, the parents go down and as always, they're like, oh, thank you so much for coming and Kevin's mom's like thank you so much babysitter lady I I don't really I'm not gonna give her a name because I feel like I'm gonna I'm gonna get confused actually no we're calling her Kate screw it all right she's like oh, okay thank you so much for coming like I know it was really last minute but we're so grateful you're here I'm sure you and Kevin will get along really well Anyways, right, so Kevin, I think he's probably, like, mid-match mid, mid -match or something, and, you know, his mom is like, hey, Kevin, come down here, meet your babysitter, so he's like, all right, be down there in a second, finishes up the match, goes downstairs, is like, hey, I'm Kevin, nice to meet you, and, you know, Kate, the babysitter, let's hope I don't forget the name, because I just made her name up on the spot, so I don't have it written down, anyways, right, Kate, the babysitter's like, hey, Kevin, you know, I'm gonna be your babysitter for the night, you know, I, uh, you know, I don't know, like, we're gonna have a great time, whatever, standard talk, whatever, and eventually, Kevin's mom and dad leave, they said they'd be back, like, around 12 or 1, they were going to a pretty late night event or whatever, so obviously they couldn't leave Kevin alone at this point, and so yeah, Kevin and the babysitter are actually kind of chilling, Kevin told me in the DMs, and by the way, send in your stories to my Instagram if you want to be featured, have your stories featured on the channel, Kevin was telling me that, you know, Kate, the babysitter, seemed pretty chill at first, like, they legitimately just were, you know, chilling out, having a pretty decent time, and, you know, dinner came around, and, you know, she was actually a pretty good cook, apparently. I don't know exactly what she made. Maybe she made some, like, nice mac and cheese or something, bro. Like, maybe she made some, like, I don't know, probably didn't, like, make a, you know, a filet mignon steak or something, but it was still pretty good food. They were having a pretty good time, so they eventually, she's like, all right, Kevin, what do you want to do? Like, do you want to watch a movie or something? And Kevin honestly said, like, hey, like, I'm in the middle of, like, you know, I want to, like, I don't know, grind some Minecraft or something. You don't actually have to be there for that. I'm totally fine just going upstairs and kind of calling it a night and having, and you can kind of just chill down here. Because, like, even though Kevin was, like, 13, 14, 12, I don't actually know, he was, like, old enough that, like, he could have been left alone, but, like, not old enough that it would, like, make no sense for him to have a babysitter. So we kind of knew what, like, the gig was, like, babysitting, you go there, you get paid just to chill, and, like, it can be either a really hard job or a really easy job, and Kevin also knew that, like, if he offered her that she could just sit there on her phone and, like, watch their TV or whatever for hours and get paid, like, decent money for that instead of actually having to, like, watch him, and he would just go and play, like, Minecraft and then go to sleep, he knew for a fact that she would take him up on the offer, and guess what? She took him up on the offer. She's like, yeah, no, dude, that's that's fine. Go ahead. Like, that's good with me. And honestly, dude, if I was a babysitter and the kid I was saying, like, oh, babysitting was like, hey, I'll go up into my room. I'll, like, go play Minecraft. You can sit there on your phone and watch TV and get paid for, like, the next five hours. I'd be kind of an idiot to say, no, I'm going to watch you instead. I'm going to put in more effort than necessary. Anyways, right, so Kevin goes upstairs. And, uh, you know, things are pretty normal. He's just playing some Minecraft, playing some Bed Wars, playing some Fours. Um, 
not playing on a MacBook Air, uh, clicking with a trackpad, which I did for like the first two months I played Bed Wars, I was not very good, man. I think I had like a negative KD. It was really bad. Anyways, right, things were, th things seemed pretty normal for a little bit, but while Kevin was playing his like fours and Bed Wars or whatever, right, he was there, he eventually heard the door open and he was like, wow, my parents are back already? But then, you know, he, so he kind of like, you know, he, he didn't get off his game because like he didn't need to if his parents were home. He would have just stayed there, chilled, playing some more Minecraft or whatever. But instead, like he doesn't hear his mom's voice. He doesn't hear his dad's voice. But instead, he hears a voice of another man and he also hears the voice of a babysitter. So he's a little bit confused. So, you know, Kevin eventually like finishes up. He's in no like he's in no hurry. He's, there's no urgency to his claim or whatever. So, you know, he finishes up his game and then he goes kind of like he goes out of his room and he listens and he hears the babysitter talk with this guy and he's like you know he kind of puts two and two together and realizes that this is a guy friend or more likely a boyfriend and you know he probably assumes that like you know she probably shouldn't invite anyone over especially since you know kevin's mom probably didn't know about it but at the same time kevin wasn't really going to do anything about it he wasn't going to like make a stink he had a pretty good deal like he was just there like playing minecraft like I don't know why he'd want to ruin that and it really wasn't a big deal that you know the babysitter's boyfriend was there well or so he thought. Yeah, so this is the point of the story where things start to go really downhill. Uh, anyways, right, so, you know, Kevin, he's just playing some Minecraft, just chilling there. And that's when he hears the babysitter in this mysterious guy who he does believe to be her boyfriend, which, spoiler, it is Kate, the babysitter's boyfriend, it is. And I'm not going to give him a name, he's just the babysitter's boyfriend, right? He hears the guy and, you know, Kate, the babysitter, walking up the stairs. And he's, like, a little confused because he was kind of thinking he'd be, you know able to be left alone, right? He, for some reason, he thought that, like, you know, they might be coming up to, like, babysit him or something together, which really made literally no sense to him because he's, like, they got a pretty good gig going, and especially, like, if her boyfriend is here, why would they want to, like, hang out with me, too? That makes literally no sense. And he hears them walk up to the room and then walk right by it. So, you know, at this point, Kevin is sitting there playing some, you know, some bed wars or whatever, and he's pretty confused. He's just like, dude, like, what? Why are they walking by? Like, where could they possibly go? <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, it's not, it, it gets worse from here, guys. My, apolo my apologies in advance. So at this point, right, Kevin is sitting there playing some bed wars, some Minecraft, some whatever, right? And he, they walk by his room, and he has literally no idea what else is up there. He's like, okay, well, they're not going to the bathroom, right? Because there's a bathroom downstairs. You know, they're not going to, like, a, the storage closet room because there was kind of like a storage room where there's just, like, random stuff. Why would they want to go there? They're not going to my parents' bedroom because what would they want to do in my... No, 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 this... No, 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 they wouldn't... No, 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 no. They, they wouldn't do that, man. They wouldn't do that, man. That's not the case. There's no, 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 there, there, there's no way. And then Kevin, who's, he's starting to have like a bit of a realization, right? That something not so great is about to go down. He's sitting there and realizes that he hears a door open and he's close enough to the bathroom that he realizes it's not the bathroom, right? And also the storage closet, you know, he, he just knows it's not the door of the storage closet. So he realizes that the door that was just opened was the door to his parents' bedroom. And he's like, what? Things are about to go downhill pretty quickly, but... <coughs> Ha. Huh. Oh, sorry. Things <laughs> things are about to go downhill pretty quickly, but yeah, uh, before that happens, uh, today's keyword or special word of the day to comment down below is bed, B-E-D. So comment that. I'll try and heart as many of those comments as I can. And also, today is your lucky day because for every single person who leaves a like on this video and also subscribes, they will receive literally nothing. I know, fantastic deal. Anyways, uh, let's get back into it. Anyways, right, so Kevin's just sitting in his room, and he's kind of just thinking to himself, okay, why did they just go into my parents' bedroom? That's pretty weird, like, I, I, I don't know why they do that, like, that's, that's pretty strange. And he hears a little bit of talking, and he's just like, are they, did they go in there to, like, get something quickly? Like, what, did they want a pillow for downstairs? Were they uncomfortable? Like, he, he just couldn't really figure it out at this point. And they were staying in there for quite a long time. <laughs> Uh, and then, okay, so I'm going to leave a lot to the imagination with the rest of my explanation of this part of the video, and also so YouTube doesn't go bing-bang with my channel or anything. I mean, I, they don't really care, but uh, they, they kind of do. They sometimes do. But anyways, uh, when a mommy and daddy love each other, <laughs> you know what? I'm not even going to try and, like, speak around it. You guys can figure it out on your own if you'd like to. For all you know, they're just literally just solving quadratic equations in there. Maybe they're doing something else. I don't know. I'm going to leave your... Uh, 
I'm going to leave your imagination to figure out exactly what you want them to do. Yeah, if you want them to be playing a you know very long game of Monopoly where they're shouting very loudly at each other, <laughs> uh, that could definitely be it, I guess. I mean, I guess I don't really know. Anyways, right, so Kevin is just thinking to himself, you cannot be serious, bro. You cannot be serious. Like, you got to be kidding me, bro. Like, you seem so chill, like Babysitter Kate. You seem normal. You seem like you wouldn't do something completely crazy, right? You seem normal, dude. You seem normal. But anyways, right, you know, he's sitting there, he's just like, you know what, I'm just gonna play some Minecraft, man, like, screw this, uh, not literally, they're up to that, but, uh, screw this, bro, like, I'm just gonna play some Minecraft, uh, you know, I'm just gonna chill here, I'm just gonna sit and whatever, like, you know what, I don't really care, I think it's gross, I think it's weird, especially, like, you know, obviously my parents would not approve of that, it's their own bedroom, that's gross, but, like, I don't really care, man, I'm going to play some Minecraft, and, you know, when you know, the next day rolls around, I'm going to tell my mom, and she will never be my babysitter again. But until then, I'm just going to enjoy my life. I'm going to play some Minecraft. I'm just going to chill out. And honestly, dude, like, I get, it makes sense. Like, why not? Like, at this point, he's like, what am I going to do? Walk in on them intentionally? Like, of course I'm not going to do that, right? But anyway, so, you know, Kevin is sitting there, and what he does is he hears, he hears a car pull up, and he's like, oh, dude, is another one of the babysitter's friends back? Because he checks the clock. And the clock only says 10.30. So he's like, oh, my parents are supposed to be back at like 1. So at first he thinks it's like one of the babysitter's friends like coming over. And he's like, okay, whatever. Like that's getting more annoying. The fact that she would do everything that she's already done and also invite, invite more friends over. Like what's she trying to do? Like throw a party here? But then he realized, right, you know, because he got up and he's like, I want to see this. And he wasn't in the middle of a game anyways. And he was invested enough. He got up and he looked outside and he saw there was his mom and dad's car. And he was like, oh my God, like wait a minute, like, hold up, like, wait a minute, you're back early? And at this point, he's like, you know what, I'm just gonna play oblivious, right? I, I don't even want them to know. I don't even want them to know that, like, I know any of this, right, you know? So what he does is he goes, you know, into his room, and he's just playing Minecraft. And his parents come in, and they open the door, and they're not, like, quiet or anything, dude. Like, his parents are pretty loud and coming in, but, you know, for uh, if, if you're distracted and loud yourself, you might not hear them. Uh, and I wonder who was distracted and being loud at the moment. But anyways, right, you know, uh, you know, the mom walks up and the dad walks up as well. Because they go to, like, you know, get changed and undressed. And they can't find the babysitter. So they're just, like, a little confused and also a little concerned. They're like, oh, my God, like, where'd they go? And they just assume that they're in, like, the some kind of room of the house. Maybe they're both in, you know, uh, Kevin's room. So they walk into Kevin's room. And, you know, the mom's like, hi, Kevin. Where, where's your babysitter? And Kevin is just like, oh, I've just been playing Minecraft. I don't know. Knowing exactly well what just happened. So Kevin's just sitting there, and he's playing Minecraft. And he's just kind of sitting there nervously because he knows, like, what's about to happen. So his parents walk out of the room, and they walk to their room. And all Kevin hears is he hears the door open. And he just hears his mom screaming, What do you think you're doing in my bedroom? I paid you to watch over my son, not this, what, I, like, you know, et cetera, et cetera. And just, like, screaming and screaming. At this point, Kevin's just, like, sitting there. Playing some Minecraft, getting some emeralds. He wants one of those good upgrades. He wants to get some potions and maybe an ender pearl. He's just having a time of it by himself. And you know, and he hears and he wa hears all these people walk by his room. And obviously it's like the mom and the dad and the babysitter and the babysitter's boyfriend. And the, and the mom's like, I can't believe this. Get out of my house this instant. So when it was right. After all the commotion, there's a little period of silence, and then, you know, Nick's mom, Nick's mom, Kevin's mom, have I been calling the guy Nick if I have my bad? Kevin. Kevin's mom comes in, and, he's like, and she's like, hey, Kevin, like, uh, do you have any idea of, like, or what have you been doing for the last couple hours? And Kevin's like, oh, I just told the babysitter I was going to go up and, you know, play some Minecraft, and I've been doing that, and I haven't really seen her, like, you know, what happened? And, you know, Kevin's mom's like, oh, nothing, like, yeah, it's nothing. And Kevin, obviously knowing what happened and exactly what happened, really, he didn't say anything. He didn't question. He was like, oh, okay. And uh, Kevin's mom did say one thing. She was like, you know, only thing I will say is you probably won't be having, you know, uh, uh, babysitter Kate anytime soon. Uh, and Kevin's like, okay, that's fine with me. <laughs> no problems. And then Kevin's mom leaves the room and Kevin's just sitting there just like, dude, <laughs> what? What just happened? What is my life? Subscribe if you haven't already, and now go watch another video. There's some on screen, some on the sidebar. Uh, go watch it or I'll be very, very sad.